Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, you know these TCU guys, especially the Dallas guys, are locked in on uh, Cade Cunningham. They've done a good job so far. Cade hadn't finished that the ring. Look at our first half stats brought to you by Ally. And you see the key stats. Kevin Samuel came to play 11 points leading the TCU Horn Frogs. Good shot blocker fading away. Not the answer. Go right through his chest. Here's another turnover. Could be an easy two at this end. And a dunk. But a uh, little too early right now to just say who is the number one pick. Jalen Green, Eric Mobley from USC, the big fellow, reminds me of Chris Bosch. But certainly Kate Cunningham is going to be an outstanding NBA player. Chris Bosch, you had to go back to the Metroplex references, didn't you, Fred? Absolutely. Look at that move. Here's Cade with a nice move. She coming out of a timeout. What do you, what's your A.T. Wilson, the outstanding redshirt freshman for the... Jayhawks, but how about Marcus Garrett? How about uh, Micah Peavy? How about Kyler Edwards for Texas Tech? Well, this Big 12 conference is full of those great players from uh, Dallas-Fort Worth. Last time I checked, there were about 130 high schools from the west side of Fort Worth to the east side of Dallas. Here's Cunningham. He told Coach Underwood, he goes, hope you're okay with this, but I just offered a freshman a scholarship. But uh, there's no doubt he's going to be a very good pro. Here he is with the ball. Gives it up. Pass. That's a dunk in the NBA. And he follows Nebhart. One Calls tough his own player. number and cashes in. Like that. RJ's got 16 tonight. And that was no offense by TCU, just a good individual play. Cut like everybody else. You just can't win consistently anymore with the type of one and done guys that are coming into college basketball.